Welcome back to the shooting channel. And I've got the next couple of films I'm going to do is ones that are Italian gun manufacturers because a lot of you are saying about all the Italian gun manufacturers that are built in the Gordoni Valley up in the north of Italy. So the kind of that it's a bit of the battle of the gun of the Italian gun manufacturers. And you have got every single gun manufacturer there. They range from a thousand pounds to three, four, five thousand pounds. I'm going to be completely honest. They're all built, ex bringing out Beretta, Prazzi, and Fausti. The rest of the manufacturers are built very, very, very similar. They're all machine-made guns and hand-finished. And it's the way they have brought the cost down of the guns whereas the Spanish manufacturers and this is why a lot of the Spanish gun trade have actually died a death the Spanish manufacturers were all still built by hand so the Italian manufacturers have changed and got CNC machines and if you go to the Gordani Valley and again I have done trips and I've taken people over there in the past and you can see exactly how those guns right the way from Betanzoli to Fierce right the way up to Rosini, Cesar Guarini, Zolli, and they're built very, very similar. I've got the Cesar Guarini Maxim, um, and I'm just going to go through and tell you a little bit about these particular guns. The only thing I'm going to say with Caesar Guarini, they're great guns, they come with fabulous wood. They are very, very good at putting good wood on it. But if you go on to Gun Trader, the second-hand value of Caesar Guarini do plummet quite a lot. So that is the only thing to think about with this particular gun. And the good thing about the Gun Trader is you can actually see the value of the second-hand guns. So I'm just going to grab this gun out and I was actually looking last night and I was looking on Gun Trader at all of the all of the guns on there and just looking at the prices and I don't know why I really don't know why but Caesar Guarini's second hand price has just just they've just fallen that little bit I don't know why maybe you can answer me that question have you got a Caesar Guarini have you tried to sell it what were you offered for it when you tried to sell it? Please comment below if you've got an answer. So, I pull this gun out. And from just literally the side on, it looks pretty. Nice piece of wood, nice recoil pad, external chokes, ventilated barrels, ventilated ribs, nice engraving all the way through. So they do look the pretty, they do look the part. They come with a lot of extras. They come with external chokes and internal chokes. Um, this specific model actually comes with e external chokes, but it comes with eight chokes. It comes with an Allen key to take the stock off, comes with your socks, comes with a nice ABS case. So it comes with all the gear. Again, I would say it actually feels sporting rib, it feels quite balanced. This specific one is actually quite high in the comb as well, but let's shoot, let's shoot it and let's see what it's like. Ball.
feels comfortable. Does feel comfortable. Looks nice, looks the part, feels comfortable. The Caesar Greenies generally will start at retail start at about £3,000 if you want to go and buy one new off the shelf. You can have a look on Gun Trader to see what the second hand value of them are, but that's what they start at is about £3,000. Full. My only concern with this particular gun is it is quite light. It's got a palm swell there, but it's not quite. Um, it's not fat enough there for me. That's my personal opinion. I like to have a little bit more something there to hold. That's my only concern. Paul. But it's an all-round gun. I can't fault it. It's a really great gun. Maybe you can answer me. Is the price right on Caesar Greenies? Is the price wrong? Please comment below if you've had if you've had owned a Caesar Greenie or if you're thinking about a Caesar Greenie, please comment below. L look at all the other gun, Italian gun manufacturers and see what you think. And 90% of them i have done Bettenzolis, Rosinis, they are all built within 10 minutes of each other. So have a think about what I say. If anyone's got any comments on this, Please let me know, please comment below and let me know what you think and what you think of the value, what you think of the actual guns. I actually quite like this, quite a nice gun. Fits in there, ticks in the box. I hope you've enjoyed this programme. Please like and subscribe. Any information you want on this gun, please comment below and we'll see you on the next one.